Welcome to Seize the Mains by Raj Malhotra's IAS Academy. I am Sirbi Sardana and this is season 3 of our Daily Answer Writing Initiative. This initiative is running in parallel with our website which is rajiasacademy.com. On our website in the Mains Answer Writing section, we upload one question for UPSC and State Civil Services Mains every day. From Monday to Saturday, every day this initiative is running. And we also upload a model answer to that ki is question ka answer kaise likha jana chahiye. Not only this, every day at 9 p.m. we discuss with you how to approach the question, how to write a good answer for that question so that you can score maximum marks for a particular question. Now this initiative doesn't end here. After learning it from us, after looking at the model answer, after going through this video, what you have to do is try to write your own answer because that's how you will learn. Try to write your own answer, post it in the comment section under this question on our website rajaisacademy.com. The link is present in the description below. Go to mains answer writing section, post the question in the comment section. Click a picture from any of your devices or just type the answer, upload that in the discuss platform here in the comment section and our team will give you their feedback in the next 48 hours, not more than that. So you can choose to answer any of the 116 questions that we've taken on Seize the Mains and we'll respond back to you with the feedback entirely free of cost. So the question for today is 3D printing or which is also known as additive manufacturing. 3D printing was taken in detail in our weekly current affairs today on our YouTube channel in the Geography, Environment, Science and Technology weekly current affairs lecture. So uh, for more clarity of the topic, you can refer to that video also. Here we'll discuss just the contents of the answer. So very simple question, describe additive manufacturing and its applications. See 3D printing is very much in news. In February 2022 this year, February this year, the government came up with national strategy on additive manufacturing. So yes, you can expect questions on 3D printing anytime in prelims and in mains because ISRO has been launching a lot of initiatives. The recent engine that was tested, it had some 3D printed parts. Also one of the private sector, uh, private startups that has launched Agni Cool startup, it has launched the first 3D printed engine for the second stage of its rocket. So that is a huge leap for India. Also, they've got a patent for that engine. So that is a huge development for India. That's why this question has been framed. First part of the question talks about describe additive manufacturing, which is also known as 3D printing. So that is what you call additive uh, 3D printing. Basically, describe additive manufacturing and its applications. The thing you need to notice here is that the directive here is describe. So you just, just do not have to define, define and give application straight away. You need to add other parts also. You need to describe what is 3D printing. Kafi detail mein aapko explain karna padega. Then let's move on to the next part. Discuss the features of national strategy on additive manufacturing. Now see the directive here is discuss. Second part major directive hai, that is discuss the features. So you don't have to just uh, note down the features. Aapko sir features likhna nahi hai, usko discuss karna hai. Discuss means you have to write the other side also. Agar usse kuch challenges associated hai. If there is some statistics or data that is not in favor or that could go against of the national strategy or what do you think? Will it be possible to attain the aims that this national strategy is coming up with? So this all has to be covered in this question. Briefly, I'll give you an over overview. I'll take you through the answer. In the introduction, we define what is additive manufacturing. So, this is our answer. Shuru ho hai. We'll define what is additive manufacturing or what is 3D printing briefly. Then, in the body paragraph 1, first of all, we'll explain 3D printing more. Ki 3D printing se hame kya ho sakte what can be the benefits? And in a very short format, we'll write the applications also. What can be the applications? Benefits plus applications. Benefits and applications gives a justification for the uses of 3D printing and gives a justification that yes, this question is important. That's how you proceed to your next part that is body paragraph 2, which is your discuss part. First of all, you have to write the features of the national strategy on additive manufacturing by Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology. So features will take around two slides. After that, you need to discuss some challenges. Ki is, uh, 
स्ट्रैटेजी को अटेन करने में या इंडिया में थ्री प्रिंटिंग इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर या एनवायरनमेंट सेटअप करने के लिए क्या चैलेंजेस हैं व्हाट आर द चैलेंजेस ऑन द वे सो ब्रीफली चैलेंजेस विल बी कवर्ड हियर वी हैव फुल सेंटेंसेस यू कैन राइट अ शॉर्ट पैराग्राफ फॉर चैलेंजेस एंड देन इन द कंक्लूजन वील कंक्लूड बाई राइटिंग वॉट एवर रीसेंट इशूज दैट वी हैव सीन रीसेंट इवेंट्स दैट वी हैव सीन विच शो आज द यूजेस ऑफ थ्री प्रिंटिंग एंड देन वील कंक्लूड बाई सेंग दैट येस इट इज अ वेरी प्रोमिसिंग टेक्नोलॉजी विच हैज मेजर बेनिफिट्स इन टाइम्स टू कम so yes let's start with introduction let's start with the first part which talks about describe additive manufacturing and its applications so very simply we'll give the definition additive manufacturing which is also known as 3d printing just be careful you might not see the see the word 3d printing in your paper directly you could also be asked about additive manufacturing it refers to a construction of three dimensional object from a digital 3d model by adding materials layer by layer layer by layer this term is very important it uses computer aided designing to make prototypes or working models of objects by laying down successive layers of material such as plastic resin thermoplastic metal fiber or ceramic so right now uh, is uh, this agni cool startup they have uh, developed an engine engine banaya hai unhone rocket ke liye so some metal or some alloy must be used so you can write here alloys also with the help of the software that you have given to the computer the model to be printed is first developed by the computer pehle computer ek model develop karta hai ek shape develop karta hai and according to that it gives instructions to the 3d printer so it normally works like an inkjet printer ek normal printer ki tarah kaam karta hai normal printer aapko ek 2d ek paper format mein aapko printed image deta hai but what a 3d printer does it gives you real life objects then moving on to the describing part again 3d printing reduces overall construction cost kyunki aapko kisi badi cheez se ek shape uh, produce nahi karni hai you do not have to create a lot of waste aapko ek solid rectangular piece se ya uh, cuboid piece se aapko kuch ek chhota figure nahi banana hai choti cheez nahi banani hai so waste is not generated construction cost reduces significantly and brings down the related carbon footprint or you can also say environmental pollution is decreased it also increases productivity of labor or labor involved because jo bhi cheez jo bhi shape uh, jo bhi cheez banani hai wo directly banayi ja sakti hai the labor does not have to spend time you know in uh, bringing down the things and offers raw material flexibility utilization of eco friendly materials in a more efficient manner now talking about applications you can just give a list of applications of uh, biotechnology mein bahut zyada use hai 3d printing ka artificial tissues artificial organs have been in news for the past 5 years at least or even more than that so yes uh, make sure that you mention all of it so prosthetic limbs can be developed other body parts including organs can be developed homes and other buildings can be developed recently the government of india has decided ki ladakh area mein jo bhi troops hain jo ki hame hamari country defend kar rahe hain they will be given 3d printed accommodation so again this was a news so yes homes and other buildings can be developed food medicine firearms liquid structures glass products acrylic objects the list is uh, exhaustive it is unending clothing medical models and devices everything can be developed using 3d printing now in the body paragraph 2 we'll discuss the features of national strategy on additive manufacturing discuss the features on of national strategy on addit additive manufacturing let's see what are the features here so the strategy aspires to achieve 5% of global additive manufacturing market share and there to add nearly us dollar 1 billion to the gdp by 2025 gdp mein almost 1 billion dollars add karenge 3d printing materials generate karke ya 3d printing machines generate karke and overall overall the globe whatever 3d printing uh, developments are being carried out we want to own 5% of global 3D printing market share. So that is uh, the vision of this um, national strategy on additive manufacturing. The second one is innovation and R and D research and uh, development ecosystem will be encouraged in public-private partnership model. So 
पूरा गवर्नमेंट मॉडल नहीं होगा फुल फंडिंग विल नॉट बी गिवन बाय गवर्नमेंट या जो पूरा इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर है दैट विल नॉट बी गिवन बाय गवर्नमेंट पीपीपी मॉडल हैज हैज बीन ऑफ इमेंस बेनिफिट टू आर कंट्री आल्सो दिस क्वेश्चन रिगार्डिंग पीपीपी मॉडल पब्लिक प्राइवेट पार्टनरशिप मॉडल हैज बीन आस्ड मल्टीपल टाइम्स इन यूपीएससी मेंस बहुत सारे मॉडल्स होते हैं पब्लिक प्राइवेट पार्टनरशिप में यू हैव दिस बिल्ड ऑपरेट ट्रांसफर मॉडल यू हैव ईओटी मॉडल इज देयर so there are many models under the ppp model make sure that you cover this as a separate topic before sitting for your prelims or mains to transform existing research knowledge base to develop additive uh, manufacturing grade materials 3d printer machines like ppp model se kya karenge research and development promote karenge additive manufacturing grade materials will be developed kyunki aapko machine mein kuch na kuch मेटालिक एलोए या प्लास्टिक या कुछ भी फैब्रिक डालना पड़ेगा जिससे आपका एक रियल लाइफ ऑब्जेक्ट क्रिएट हो सके सो दो मटीरियल्स दीज आर नॉट नॉर्मल मटीरियल्स आर यूज ऑन एन एवरी डे बेसिस वो मटीरियल्स ऐसे होने चाहिए कि अगर आप किसी मटीरियल की वायर भी सप्लाई कर रहे हैं एज एन इनपुट दैट वायर शुड बी कन्वर्टेबल इन टू अ इन टू सम अदर सॉलिड ऑब्जेक्ट इजिली बाय योर थ्री डी प्रिंटर सो न्यू टाइप्स ऑफ मटीरियल्स थ्री डी प्रिंटर मशीन्स एंड प्रिंटेड इंडिजिनस प्रोडक्ट्स प्रिंटेड और क्रिएटेड इंडिजिनस प्रोडक्ट्स फॉर वास्ट डोमेस्टिक एंड इंटरनेशनल मार्केट इन वेरियस सेक्टर्स इंक्लूडिंग इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स फोटोनिक्स मेडिकल डिवाइस एग्रो एंड फूड प्रोसेसिंग एट्सेट्रा देन वॉट यू हैव अ डेडिकेटेड नेशनल सेंटर वुड बी क्रिएटेड with the participation of all the stakeholders that is one of the features of this policy also it aims to create an ecosystem for creation of nearly 100 new startups thanks to this strategy agni cool has been you know receiving the support from isro to develop this 3d printed rocket engine which they've also got a patent for also a uh, 10 new sectors 10 uh, additive manufacturing sectors 1 lakh new skilled manpower manpower or jobs development of 500 3d printed products and 50 indian 3d printing technologies on material material is the input material that you give then machine that is your 3d printing machine process and software very important part of 3d manufacturing so in addition awareness of adoption of this these products would be created amongst people to facilitate the growth awareness is most important whenever you are writing about a policy just make sure that you highlight that awareness is a part of it without awareness if people like you and me do not know about 3d printing then we must not be discussing it here and we would have not known about the benefits of this technology so awareness is a part of any new technology then uh, coming to the challenges first of all um, very new technology that's why uh, the domain is very niche and there are no global qualifications or certifications or norms it is hard to convince the industry and ministers to push for its adoption then the third one is risk of job losses because many of the materials would be produced by a machine now that's why whatever uh, Uh, materials we were resorting to earlier they were produced by skilled manpower they will end up losing their jobs especially in the short run then actual printing is cheap but parts to build a 3d printer the software the materials these are very expensive so yes in the long run the 3d printing will reduce the carbon footprint or environmental pollution and it will help us produce products in a cheaper uh, in a uh, you know at less than the cost that we were producing but for the short run it is a very expensive technology so these are the challenges but despite these challenges 3d printing seems to be gradually flourishing in india why are we writing this line because in the past one week about this uh, you know accommodations in ladakh using 3d printing isro using a uh, 3d printing part in one of its in ce20 engine and this agni cool using 3d printed engine all these have seen have been seen in current affairs so we can see that yes 3d printing technology is flourishing in india so recently rocket engines and their parts have been efficiently developed using this technique giving a major boost to the 3d printing industry in the country and also it also generates trust factor in the youth the youth stays back in india the youth understands that yes after pursuing a professional degree or some uh, certification they can stay back in their country and get good jobs so more applications are being worked upon and the technology is, co is conceived to provide major benefits again this uh, conclusion is just of two lines 
we have successfully addressed all parts of the question the discuss part has been addressed with challenges and features the applications uh, have been described 3d printing as a technology has been described so that's your full answer make sure that you visit your um, visit the website rajaisacademy.com to read uh, to read this answer in full text format and share your answers with us as soon as possible stay tuned i'll see you with another discussion tomorrow